Thank you. Kila binadamu hata watu walio diaspora karibuni salimia mtu mwambie ni mwezi wa ribon. Mwambie ribon ni nini? Tuendelee sasa tuingie kwa neno. Thank you. Litaenda kwa ufupi haraka haraka. Amen. Ni mwezi wa Aha, Kiswahili tutasema nini? Ha? Kiswahili ni mwezi wa kuzaliwa. Hadi wakwa? Ha? Kuzaliwa upya, wengine wamesema kuzaliwa upya. Kuna wengine? Kila mtu wote binadamu alikaa kwa pregnant 9 month. Alafu mwezi ule ulizaliwa mtu wote tarehe moja, tarehe thate alipata sagala netegene. Eh? Leo na jana watoto wamejaa. Na ataabiwa happy birthday mwezi wa Oktoba. Ama kutoka dakika hii ukipitisha wiki mbili ama moja wote libon walizaliwa ama he tushika nini miezi 9 ndio inakuwa mashuriti ya mwanadamu wote kwa hivyo baraka yote ya mwanadamu haipitishagi 9 month spiritually na physically ukiona Aha, unaisend Atuzami hiyo munaitisha Kuna vitu munaitisha Na kuna vitu sa kuzariwa Amen Kuna mtu wana demand So kuna ile promise uliahidiwa januari Kulikuwa na kesha ikasema eh, It is the day of recovering all what we have lost We have lost Kwa hivyo Hii diyo ilikuwa ahadi ya madhabahu hii Na vitu zote siriokuliwa Na zige, aha, pare nyuma inasema, salvation, aha, education, kama nigepata mtu wa inue hivi. Hapa tu, aishukue hapa. Aha, hapa tu inue hivi, aha, thank you. Education, ilikuwa hivi. Aha, recovering, finances, marriage, health, family, education, salvation. That is the... Driven scripture, Joel 2.25 Inasema ya kuwaba Na mimungu Ni tawape Unajua prophetic word Haitokagi hivo bure Ati ni ya msizi muko Iyo ilikuwa yetu Iyo ilikuwa yangu Kama ya ilikuwa yako Leo ni nakukubusha Kama defender na demanda wa hii madhabahu Kama umeitanisho na hii madhabahu Kama umekua imani yako hapa hata leo Prophecy ya mwaka mpya Ya madhabahui ya mtu wote ya likuwa Ilisema it is the year of recovery We are not talking like that Na juu iyo begu tulifatia fatirete Mtu wote ya lishika miba January Are you together? Miba yote January Kuruka mwaka Chui Tutoto tumeja areba wode Nye Sijui recovering yako kama umeanza kulia. Ujue in the spiritual realm everybody kai madhabahu. Sio kina huko he madhabahu because Bible say whoever hear the prophecy and he will never proclaim it. It will take long or it will wither. Yeyote asikia unabii na ikose kuidai. Eh? Ya esaka sana ama ifirizia na huko. Na many time, eh, kuwitha hile kuisha isha hivyo inaitu waje. Ina? Ina kauka. Bona pewe sifa. Watu wegi maunabinyigi na ogewa isipo kosa demanda. Ina kaukaga. Igine, ina, ko, ina take. Unapata unabi ugeishukua February ama January. Utaishukua twedi sigiste. Ishukulio na mtoto. Ulapata piso pesa unaombea. Hauja dimadi. Loho alisema nini? Iliongewa nini? Juhapa dibo nasema. 
tukizoeana walio tuliwe hubiria hata wewe ama uzoe the spiritual commander ama physical commander wewe unakosaga directing unakosaga order na ndipo saa hizi kama nchi yetu tunaoda kwa president amri jeshi jeshi inaogao hivi tunaoda kutoka kwa cs tunaenda hapa kwa minister are you together that is the chain of command that is how the spiritual kwako kwa nyumba kuna mahali order inatoka then itakuwa authorized so hapa unabi ule ulineno hapa ulineno ya kwamba oh recover all that we have frost so miaka hiyo ingine tulilos so tukapewa ya kwamba joeli bili tukapata begu fertility everybody alipata fertilize alipata fertility ya kwamba na akaabiwa umeconceive in the spiritual realm in the physical realm that today umeconceive recovering na chochote ulianza ju mtu healing inaanzaga recovery healing inaanzaga internally internally then recovering inaanzaga physically outside the outlook uh, recovering ni lazima uone mtu amerecover outlook healing is internal na watu wengi huaga wanaobaga recovery kabla ya healing so today mtu aisa kuulipona lakini huja recover are you together so process hiyo yote uli, ile ile ugojo wa rust ile ugojo wa rust katika hii madhabahu katika wote walipata hata kama hujaiona ulianza ku heal 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 sasa ni mwezi ju tume heal recovery inaonekana oh haja kana mtoto hai alikuwa mjamzito ye recovery ndio huyo mtoto wake oh hakuwa kazi oh hakuwa psychological tosha na katikati hapa eh hiyo ndio kazi ya mapato yangu oh biashara ile nilikuwa nafanya hata kama sija pa haijainuka ukweli nawesaka kulipa nyumba hata kama sijapata pesa mingi ukweli nimenunua hii na nimenunua hii na nunua hii na hata kama saa hizi hata kama kwangu hakuja kuwa na amani nyingi ukweli tumepatana patana kidogo na watoto na jamii hello that is healing now and when you get healing there is a confidence of recovering pigia bwana makofi yule yote ananipata <laughs> haleluya watu wa mungu i believe kuna mtu hapa hana kazi lakini mambo yake inaenda hakuna mungu ame alificha lost watu hawajajua so healing ugojwa ulizimia hauendelei ama eh ukaanza kupona vidoda pole pole ukaanza kujipokea ukaanza kujipenda ukaanza kukua na confidence because living life without confidence is like walking in the water without fruitas ama haleluya you cannot tell me that you are going to walk in the water and you don't have any fruitas you are 100% uta 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 drown so today god ukirif in life nasma akupatie fruitas so that you are not going to sink so living life without confidence is like walking in the water without a fruta and you don't know how to swim swim so number one god anatupea kama hujui ku swim anakupea fruta then kama kutoka hapa anajua you can swim unapata mahali pale so and i know today mahali pale tumeendelea kutoka siku ya leo katikati ya pale umefruit kwa maji risk of your life 2023 ilikuwa na tragedy god kitu moja alikupe assurance take the fruitas i don't know you don't know the way i don't know you don't know. shika fruitas hiyo ni confidence ya kwamba huta sink and i believe today september everybody is ready kuonyeshana product zile ameza juu kama huta saa hii mwezi kama matendo yako haitaonekana hapo miba yako ile miscarriage so tutaanza ku deal na spirit ya miscarriagement ju ukiendelea na miscarriagement hata 2024 hautakuwa na confidence 
So siku ya leo kabla turuke mwaka tuseme ingine let we know ni nini hii inasababisha miscarriage. Hallelujah. Amen. Everybody aliyoingia 2023 ako fertile. Hii ring ilianza na uka conceive begu ya unabii ule ulinenwa. Begu ya maono yale ulikuwa nayo ya 2023. Hallelujah. Amen. Tumebakia only a few days. Hallelujah. Tumebakia a few days. 93 days are remaining for 2023. 93 days. 93 days simebakia za 2023. So katikati ya 93 days na tumetoka 200 and tumetoka 100 and tumetoka 300 tumetoka 200 and mwaka ni wa masiku gapi? 300 and Then tumeenda siku gapi? Na itadhiri minus accountant na itadhiri eh yeah? Tumebakia na itadhiri days. How many days tumesienda? 270 272 simeenda. Na kama huja conceive unagojea wewe ni miba tu tubo ni kubwa unasema litazaa. Hauwezi zaa tena. Wewe ulipata hewa ama uko na shida tunafaa kuangalia uli miscarriage na huku tuwabia tuanze na it three days tuanze kujua we deal with the miscarriagement ili mwaka wa 2024 ukikonceive waweza zaa mwezi wa kumi. na kama sasa umezaa hii baraka ile ulikuwa naye maono utaintunza uende uongezee mtoto mwingine kwa jina la Yesu Kristo mtoto anaitwa baraka in the mighty name of Jesus are we coming now ili mwaka wa 2024 tukiigia ama mwezi wa kumi na mwezi wa kumi usikue wa, mis, wa kupiga kelele ju hapa ukimiscarriage tena unasema nini deal with the medicine deal with your treatment and observe ni ulipata pressure uka miscarriage uli misbehave katika katika uh, conceiving yako spiritual conceiving physical conceiving tabia yako tunapeagwa tunapoenda mtu anapo conceive kuna kuaga na kliniki tatu very important three clinic na hivyo dio three season of the year three season in year tunakuaga na three quarters three month january up to march ama Ah uh, that is first first quarters yes april may june second quote hallelujah are you together tunaingia hiyo ingine quarter hiyo ingine eh july august and september imeisha tumeenda the final quarter abai inaendaga hivi mtu akikonceive ya kwanza ile kliniki ukiwa unaendaga kupimwa unaangaliwa ah ya kwanza inaitwa ah ah woi wa mama hoi sasa mimi nilipoenda kliniki iliitwa alta gai wa matuini wa matuini baba ra washaka la nai baba nimepata wazee wa watu wote wamepika menopole na wamesahau na menopole yao wasaidie la mashakara baba baba ya kwanza inaitwa first quarter inaitwa anti semeni antinato antinato is go the first quarter ulipona vile uliingia mwaka unafaa kliniki ya kuchaji tabia ya kukaa vizuri wa kuangalia hiyo ndio naambia go caution umepata miba na hiyo miba unakaa hivi na unakaa hivi ukule chakula hii na ukaage hivyo unapeagwa order and instruction unaenda hiyo ingine ya pili baada tu ya second quarter miezi tatu ama miezi tatu kutoka hapo utaenda another clinic ya pili alafu inaitwa eh? kuna wengine wanasema what about prenatal ama outina postnatal Hello Kuna ingine prenatal ama prenatal Am I coming 
Wara wa yanga yala shongoloi Wekine saa hizi nafudisha Na walieda wanagugu Wachani kugugu saa hizi Put your memory Become a clamor Hii simu sitakuja kufuriziwa Put take care of your brain Brain is your life That is why Munaenda kanisani Hamushiki kitu juu kwa kwa gugu Gugu haita kushikia imani Chidwe Mumeenda vitu sote gugu 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 Hata unaitwa nani una gugu Unakuraga nini gugu Nyubani kwe ni nuwapi gugu Mpaka utaurizo wee we ni jeda gani gugu Unajipiga picha uyagalia ni gugu gani Ha? Huh? Jina la bwana leo polisiwe. Bibi yako anaitangwa nini? Gugu. Mtoto wako wa kwanza anaitwa wapi? Gugu. Wewe nyinyi gugu. Hata mimi ninawakanya kiroho. Bwana abariki gugu. Ninatusaidia kuinterpret. Lakini huyo ni mtoto alisoma. That is a family of an education. Hao ni family wamesoma, wameweka memory zote hapo. Kwena, where are you going? Ninataka ushike kitu. Tuendelee. Tunaita the session number 3. Post NATO. Wa kwanza tunaitaka anti NATO. January, February, March. Ulikuwa unafaa ukieda anti NATO. Take care of yourself. Don't behave yourself. Hii ni nini nimefanya. Nili mess up last year 2022. Juu nilikuwa arrogant. Juu nilikuwa hivi. Sasa nimepeo na nas. Mibayagu hili isitoke. Ninafaa kufanya hivi. Siku wana jiobea. Sasa ninafaa. Mimi nilikuwa yusina. Nilikuwa na misk. Pesa zangu nilikuwa na ita. Wakati nikona pesa. Eh, dio ninaita. Huyo nasa akakuambia, take care of what you, you are carrying. Pesa zako si bebe, maono yako acha kutagaza kwa watu, ukaingia kliniki inaitwa antinato. Ukachungwa. Baada ya mesi tatu ukaingia tena. Eh? Inaitwa prenato. It's already postinato. Ama? Postinato. Am I coming? Wasen tunapatana. Ye, yeah, ukaingia hiyo ingine. Ni nini? Ni hii kiube kikorohoni. Ni hii kiube kiko. There is a life that itakuja ikuwa divario. Ukaenda hiyo. Then, posinato. That, kwa hivyo, watu wote by, by January ilikuwa confused. Tukaigia second quarter. Abaye, tunaigiaga April, May, June. Ama? Tunainga quarter ingine. Ikaisha tukona. Haya, na ame change. Haya. Saizi anakuja chachi mapema. Wow, kuna amani kwao. Signs and symptoms. Samiba ya miesi sita already. Watu wakaanza. He, na anaka, ame change. Uh -huh. Jubaraka inaya poigia kwa mtu. Watu hafai kuzia. Ata wewe. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Hallelujah. Uh -huh. Ata wewe, kuna change. Vile ya change ikuwa. Saizi hata si noti. Pare kwa kwa nyuba hapo. Kuna makoini migi. Hama? Kuna makoini, saizi mtu waduka, hamesha ajua. Uh -huh. Deni ya last wiki ulilipa, imebakia hii. Na ilikuwa inauludana, samia sibiri. Ama, kwa hivyo signs and symptoms that fatality has already increased. Come on coming, kuna mtu na wagalesha. Eh, kukakaa hivyo. Then, mukaigia kuota hii gine. One, two. Tunaita? Huh? Ya tatu? Third? Huh? Third? Third hakuna? Third quarter inaito aje? Third quarter inaito aje? Diyo wede ukaya? Uwabiyo siku yako? Huh? Hova yaninga yala shakala nete geleshe? Haya ya ya postimata mula wa shakala nete legene? Eh? Sasa iyo mutajijazia mwede mufanya research? Hii ya kuedelea hii likuwa ya last month Abaya nilikuwa bia Take care of your bedding Juu bedding yako itajaa mtoto Itajaa baraka Iyo liyo tunabjaa Tukansa maombi inaitua eh, Three months represent God eh, Tukaita mungu wanani Wamanoa kuje kwa nyuba Abapo tukaeka bana iko hapa kubwa sana Mi God remember your bedding Ama May God remember your bedding. Are you together? Ju bedding yako kwa sara ni kwa oshi yaluwa muwana. Kwa mtu kutazariwa mtoto. Iyo boma yako itaanza kuwagezeka value. 
Hii kanisa vile mnakaa hivi eh? watu watajana kutazana watu wamemwamini Mungu watu wametaka kujaa ufalme wa Mungu utajaa hivi hivi hata hapa kuna taka viti zingine 600 sijae huku kuna viti zingine kama hizi nataka kuleta 600 ambaye juu vitada ya huduma imepanuka ni lazima nipanue vitada na nitegeneze space haleluya so kutoka leo hapa kuna hapa hapa kutajaa viti mia hapa viti 150 na hapa viti 150 zingine sinawekwa hapo katikati so hapo katikati ya hayo because god ukiamini na usiwe si msaha uko naye hii utoa peke na tunaomba ni lazima mungu arudishe recovering na recovering inakujaga na addition na increment am i coming ukapewa the date of birth ukapatiwa sasa mtoto mwingine sasa hizi ambaye amezaliwa utapewa wa kupelekaga kliniki mtoto sasa ulikuwa unaenda peke yako utaenda kliniki ingine wewe na baraka yako mtaenda kliniki ya mama na mtoto inaitwa eh eh asante hiyo mtaenda kuiangalia ndio tuendelee ju inakuwa agumu mkaenda na ndio hii sasa na ndio hii unafaa ujue baraka yote uliyobea imezaliwa na iko na iko kama sio hivyo usipige kelele tuangalie the line of fertility amen tuangalie kama tuli miscarriage juweza watu waweza kufanya umiscarriage ya kukupea pressure ama Ulipata pressure uka quit. Hello, uliabot. Labda uliona inakusumbua sana. Ukaondoa katika laini yako. So, kuna recovering. Na ninaamini kwamba mtu wote yako hapa haku miscarriage. Ni labor pain, ama? Ni struggle ya mtu akiwa amebeba pregnant. Newborn ya biashara yako, Bwana atakubariki because sisi wanaume waweza niuliza sisi hatubebagi. I'm talking about the spiritual warfare. Kuna maono umebeba hata sisi tunasemaga a woman will carry pregnant in his in his uterus uh, in his uterus and a man will carry in his brain women the when a woman ana carry the pregnant na womb sisi na sisi tunabebaga na brain na ndipo unapataga wanaume wana struggle juu uterus yako iko hapa maono yako vile mtoto atazaliwa vile atakuwa maono ya kwako iko kwa kichwa that is why unapata wamama mostly attack yao inawatakia gatubu wanaume wanatakia kwa kichwa na from today every vision you mebeba every vision every life you mebeba kutoka siku ya leo bwana akutetee in jesus name kuna mtoto wa kujenga, kuna mtoto wa maendeleo, kuna mtoto wa kulisha, umebeba kama sisi wanaume na kichwa. Mtoto umebeba kwa uterus yako. May God help you. Usimiscarriage psychologically and physically in the mighty name of Jesus. Mariko 9 that is 6 ya mwisho na Deuteronomy 11. That is a living scripture abaye nilimwambia nitaenda kwa ufupi. Kuna nguvu zinashuka hapa, Bwana atawabariki. Amen. Kitabu cha Mariko mtakatifu mlango wa tisa, mustari wa 36 Mariko tisa, mustari wa 36 akatoa kitoto akamweka katikati yao akamkumbatia akawaambia 37 mtu akimpokea mtoto mmoja wa namna hii kwa jina langu anipokea mimi na mtu akinipokea mimi humpokea si mimi bali yeye aliyenituma God bless you. Leo nitaleta kwa ufupi sana. Akatoa kitoto kimezaliwa. Kitoto watu wengi wametoa maono, Wame, wamezaa magari, wamezaa plot, wamezaa leadership. Lakini haipokelea agui. Many people you can give birth but the baby will never going to be accepted. Problem is fighting for acceptance ama pasta here ama pasta here 
But you are sapata, Yesu anasema, nabi hasikiki kwao. Hello? Nabi hasikiki kwao. Wae sapata ya kwamba, Yesu anatoka Samaria, anaeda Judea. Na amereta baraka kwao, ikakata kushukuliwa. How many people murio hapa you are struggling, already umelipa cost ya kubeba pregnant, ya kubeba maono. Lakini when you give birth your service, people are not receiving Ficha nyigi hasitokagi wakati umeshika miba. Sinatokaga wakati umetoa kitoto. Wakati umetoa leadership. When people atakaya ona, wow, huyu alikuwa kue huyu. Wow, huyu alikuwa nunue nyumba. Wow, huyu mtoto alikuwa pite hivo wakati kitoto. Yesu wakasema hivi. Ni wakati wa wa newborn. Vitu zenu zile mulipanda. Saidi yo mutaona mapato. Shamba ukipanda mesi tisa utaona Mesi sita utaona Mafuno yake na mahidi na kila kitu Bwana isu wapewe sifa Amen. Na sasa akawabia Uliokamo kila keheo keke Mutu wote akatakaye receive Hii kibaraka Na yeye abarikiwe Leo ni namuambia ni mwesu wa kumi Tumeigia Usistrago na kufaiti kupokerewa Usishide ukingangana Usikiki ujulikana we diyo mama wa boma Uzijide ukingangana we diyo baba waboma. Uzijide ukingangana ya kwaba we diyo kiogozi. Uzijide ukingangana ati hii biashara. Mungu akupatie neema ya mniuboni wako kupokelewa. The grace of acceptance. The grace of you might be received but you are not accepted. Watu wegi waesa kukaribisha lakini hawaja kupokea. Yesu wakawabia na ule atakaya pokea huyu. Leo ni naongea miezi hiyo 93 days says a change your life. Hizi 90 days says a change your life. Mtu wote alikuwa nakupiga aseme we wachana na huyu tumpokee. Mtu wote alikuwa nakupinga anga ilikata kuleta mvua upate umepokelewa. Amen. Amen. Bible inasema kitoto kilipozaliwa Yesu alileta na ule atashika atapokea huyu mtoto. Deuteronomy 11 mistari ya 9. Inasema hivi. Amen. Kitabu cha kumbukumbu la torati. Kumina moja mustari watisa. Nanyi mutapata kuzifanya siku zenu kuwa nyingi. Juu ya inchi bwana alia wapia baba zenu. Ya kuwa atawapa wao na kizazi chao. Inchi imiminikao maziwa na asali. Yes. Hawezi struggle uki, ukibeba miba. Na wakati umekonisive newborn. Haupati mahali ya kuinherit. Ha ni watu wanaahidiwa, wanaahidiwa kule bere. Na wanaabiwa ya kuamba, na nyinyi, watoto enu, kule wataeda watapokelewa. Nyuba zenu sikijega, neighbors watampokea. Hakuna shida baya, kama umejege plot, ama ununue mashaba, neighbor waede nyuma na wewe. Kitoto kile umezaliwa, umesoma, ukona digiri zako, uko tumesomesha watoto, maharipara wanaenda, wanapingwa. Watu wanaraisi motion, yeah, tukutaki, haki yetu, hatukutaki. Kwa hivyo, kitoto kiako, kia masomo, kitoto chako, sakazi, kimekataliwa. Hapa ni promise, ati yakoba mutazaa watoto, na kure wataenda, disedanti wenu, Watamiliki. Amen. Amen. They will settle. They will settle. So, yes, tunaoba baraka. Will blessing will, does your blessing will going to settle? Baraka yako ikifika hapa, ita settle. Okay, mi ni mchugaji, ni meigia kebera. Am I settled here so that I may preach? Okay, ume settle kwenu. Uh -huh. Umepata kazi ili umepata. Mungu wa mekupatia handi. Ya hiyo mtoto wa masomo. Ya hiyo mtoto wa kosi ulu mesema. Itaseto. Musichana wako wa meorewa. Kijana yako wa meorewa. Ataseto pale ataka. Hapa baibu inasema. Na vitoto zenu. Descendant yenu. Descendant ni uzao. Mimi na amini. Kiafrika ama watu wote. Duniani. Mostly wanafaiti sana kwa descendant wao. Ile shida mzee umekura. Uge litaka mtoto wako na mjukua kure. Ama. Ili umepitia ya last month. Uge litaka hii mwezi upitia. Na hakuna uchugu unapataga mtu. 
kama umeona mabaya pamoja na watoto wako ama what you go through utakagi na ndipo unaona Yesu anashika baraka anasema Mi najua nili struggle siku siku karibisho Samaria lakini ninaomba ule yote atapaye pokea huyo kuna mtu wako hapa already baraka umezaa na Mungu amefanya na ite uh, 273 siku ya salama lakini kile Mungu amekupea kimeseto kitaseto hiyo doa imeseto akawaambia niliwaahidia mkiwa hamuja za na let me ask you kama in the book of Isaiah 34 verse 16 inasema ngombe will get their meat kila hii ni ya handi hebu tuongelesha kidogo juu hiyo mhampati hiyo 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 hata mapasta wengi hawatakai kuihubiri hiyo hakuna hata pasta anataka kuhubiri Nimalize tu. Hani ni watu walikuwa jagoani, hawakuwa mahali kwao ama wako na pregnant ya kuseto. Isaia dhati, nani ametusomea? Kitabu cha Isaya, mlango wa haraka, tusirudie sana. Isaya 34 mstari wa 14. Ya hawa yaani wanyikani watakutana na umbo wa mwitu na beberu atamuita mwenziwe nam babe watoto anakaa huko na kujipatia raha tusome 16 16 tafteni katika kitabu cha Bwana mkasome hapana katika hao wote atakayekosa kuwapo atakayekosa kuwapo uli aliona kisugu atusome jinaona ni kama tunarudia Isaiah 34 from verses 14 desert creatures tusome 16 nataka point ya 16 verses 16 Look at the scroll of the of the Lord and read none of this will be missing not one will lack her mate for it is his mouth that has given the order and Hebu turudi hapa unajua amtakai kuogelesha vitu kama hizo Kiswahili kama ningepata mtu aninisomea vizuri 16 inasema hivi turudia odanga Look in the scroll of the Lord and read none of this will be missing Not one will lack her mate. Aha, tuogelea. For it is his mouth that has given the order and his spirit will gather them together. God bless you. Kiswahili tunasema aje? Tafteni katika kitabu cha Bwana, mkasome. Hapana katika hao wote atakayekosa kuwapo, hapana mmoja atakayemkosa mwenzake kwa maana kinywa changu kimeamuru na roho yake imewakusanya. God bless you. Listen. God hatakagi watu wakuwe desperate. Shetani ndiye anatakaga watu. Bible inasema no one will lack a mate. Are you together? Ah, watu watakai kuambia hivyo. Juzi nilihubiri nikahubiri nikawaambia mtu mwingine akaja akaniambia we, hiyo mahubiri umehubiri. Sawa, asante. Lakini you need to understand the promise of God. Ili wakati una struggle unakubusha wakati unaona character in a race kwa familia yenu unasema remember god you promise people in the wilderness that nobody will lack a mate are you together am i coming na sasa ili descendant zao wasisubuke unapoona character kama hii kanisa tumejaa na unaona watu kuna tabia imeraise ugudue kuna handi hamuja dai kwa madhabahu Unapoona bari yenu kuna kitu wamelak success Unaona wa, watu wako hapa nyinyi tu ndio hamuna waangalie kama ni nyinyi mmekuwa resistant ju kuna watu wataona mmejenga nyumba ya gorofa walaani devil worshipper usikule kwake so you are resistance of success you will never get it Okay Mungu amesema vitoto hizi zitakayezaliwa kusiwe mtu ataipinga haleluya Utaendesha gari watu waseme we mimi siwezi panda itaniwa hakuna wakati baraka ita, ya magari itakuja so tuangalie sisi are we the sisters are we the one that we are lacking mate at no one no one in this congregation will lack the mate 
Na ule wako nae anamuita sidwe. Na hapa ni ahadi na ahitiwa. Awe baba, apana. Leo ni siku ya kudai. Baraka zetu sitae zariwa. The new born is akae kuja. Sipokelewa katika insi ya wenye uhai. Hallelujah. Kama sisi hatujui, tunasikiaga kiimani. Ya kwaba, anybody yaliyo hapa tukikufa, tutaeda paradiso kwa imani. Ama? Tumeenda kwa dariyo nyuba. Najua hiyo kuti itatadaza. Wekini hawaja isikia, hawaja iiona. Sasa hizi, hiyo di itakuwa justification. Hiyo di itakuwa. Lakini na kuwabia, kuna hadi ya buwana. Ya kwaba, strago hile hiko. Mungu alisema na mudomo wake. Are you together? Karakteri ya muro na kuwanyu. No muhakamuri ye gai. Wa ugetia tu yoro ya udo hoyo. Tabia. Karakter baya unaona. Nilasima urize. Kwetu kwa nini kuna kaa hivyo. Wana wa Israeli wakiwa jagwani. Wakiwa bari. Waliabiwa ya kwaba. Kila moja hata kosa. Wanyama hata wanyama wanapromisiwa. Wanabiwa hata haa wanyama wote. Imagine God akikonsida wanyama. Mabeberu. Akikonsida poki mpanyi. Aki consider, let me ask yourself, ana consider poki mpaini, mede, o wadhogo, eh? Musogareli, ana wabia na anawapea hadi, hakuna munyama alio hapa, atakosa mede. Na sisi baibu inasema, tuko wa maana kuliko kila kitu duniani. Look at this. God anasema, dege saagani hawalimi. Na hawata kosa chakura Lakini sisi Tumekosa meti Wakutusaidia Tuweze kusaksid Tumekosa mtu We don't have a good mate We don't have a solo mate We don't have a friend mate All the people that we meet together They are opportunists They are advertisers Of our bad and our mess time Today people Ni naomba kama wana wa israeli wali okuwa jagwani. Wakabiu kigojeka, utapata metu wa kukufutibu. Utapata hawa. Na hawa nyama ote, hata wadogo. Kila moja, hata kosa muenzake. Bwana si akupatie muenzako muema. Akupatie muenzako hata kujali. Atakupie muenzako hata simama na webe. Akupatie muenzako hata kuobea. Atakupatie muenzako hata kujali. Pokeni name my Jesus name. Say hi to somebody. Mwambi hakuna ha, hadi ya bwana. Kila mtu atapata mwenzake. Hallelujah. Pokeni neema. Labda hujapata mwenzako wa biashara, bwana atakupatia. Labda una mwenzako wa kukujali, utapata. Labda una mwenzako wa kukusaidia, utampata. Labda una mwenzako wa kusimama na wewe, utampata. Labda una mwenzako wa kukuambia sorry, utampata. Wa kukuelimisha, utapata. Wa kukujali. Pokeni neema. Pokeni neema. Pokeni neema. The time and the month of a newborn, you may receive it in Jesus' name. Pokeni neema in Jesus' name. Urio nyobani pokeni neema. The Bible promise in the book of Isaiah 34, 16, and no one here will lack a mate. Naneno ritae derea. Uziko se chakula. Chakula chakiro.